All right, Shawnee boy. The McAllen Fine Oak Triple Cask Matured 10 year old Scotch. Sign me up. I have the propensity to get blocked out when I do straight Scotch and need a little ice to water it down. <laughs> Hello, Sixers, and welcome to Chef Iron Mike Day. Dude. Yep. Sean said it earlier. Yeah. Talk about these labels. These labels are sick. Holy so we have snack. three different hot sauces made for us and you guys from Chef Iron Mike. Chef Iron Mike's been in the restaurant biz for decades. Yeah, and I love the fact that this dude, so his hot sauces, he specifically makes for genres of food. And we love genres. I love genres. So this one is Vesuvius Italian Sriracha Sauce, Italian, specifically yes. made for Italian food. Mike said, hey guys, how about a deep dish pizza? Right. He said, hey Mike, how about a stuffed Giordano's pizza. Whoa! Do you guys hear Sean knocking that little Giordano's out of the park? Hey man, this is the Whoa. four meat Giordano's. You nailed that I, accent. Actually, yeah, you were right the first time. Handshake it. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's, that's how respectable that was. Say, that deserves a handshake. Say hi to your mother for me. Say hi to your mother for me, okay? We also have one, so this one's made specifically, it's Mexican sriracha sauce. Yeah, so we got. It's called Burning Bandito. And yeah, so we got some tacos, obviously from Big and Little's, they only Duh. do us justice. Duh. And then this other one we got is Bloody Mary seafood sriracha sauce. Um, and so we, we, by we, I mean Sean, uh, got some. Garlic calamari Woo. from Fish Bar, baby. Look, it's got the mm. tentacles in there. Mm. Little octopus, look at this. You wanna eat that? Oh, oh, bro, don't even put that in my face. Kylie, dude. homeless girl, you want some of this? Oh, bro. Yeah. Dude, we oh, out here, God. dude. We out here. Bro. So that one's good for either Bloody Mary's or oh. seafood. I got my one of my favorite fish bars, Ooh. Fish Bar. In, uh, in Lakeview. And before anybody talks smack about me not eating any of that, the, the reason being I don't think they're gonna be that I talking think, smack have you at met the scene? internet? I've never met it, what's it like? Oh boy, it is a wild place. <laughs> so the reason is, is I, Chef Iron Mike sent us these sauces asking us to try these on these specific foods. And I feel like it would be really, really rude of me to put it on a food that I know I'm gonna be disgusted by. Yeah. And then talk about that product as though it's just a horrific car accident yeah. of food. We were gonna do shrimp so cocktail, but I don't want to and bitch about coldness sure, of shrimp cocktail. Yeah. We're gonna do breaded shrimp, but that's too easy. So I was like, let's get calamari, and it just didn't come breaded. Fish bars and calamari isn't like casadis. Okay. And so Sean's it's gonna fine. do it on his own. And I love so. fish. So. And, uh, so just don't don't roast me down there, guys. Please. Roast him, roast him. In the comments below, <laughs> toast him, dude. <laughs> 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 Bam! I got you, sucker. <laughs> All right. So I think it's only right to start calamari. With calamari. I think so, right? That yeah. way you can just do your thing, or do you want to do a middle batch? No, I want to I want to do this real quick, because I want to get to these other two big, dope-ass foods. Yeah. But I can't tell you how much this looks exactly like my sister. Really? You don't yeah. have a sister, do you? That's her. Her you name's, her name's Bloody like, Mary. That looks like, uh, what was that movie with that fake-ass rabbit? Get me some money, too. Yeah, Jessica Rabbit. That looks a little bit like Jessica Rabbit. It does. Did you ever go in the bathroom and play Bloody Mary as a kid? Too scared. I was too much of a just scaredy cat. Yeah, kind of like you are with seafood, right? Exactly. Oh! All right, so Chef Iron Mike, I'm going pretty, pretty heavy on the sauce. Obviously, this is our first time having any of these. I get a quick little learning lesson, don't I? All right, Chef Iron Mike, this is the Bloody Mary on the fish bar calamari. I looked away. Out of respect. It's phenomenal. The sauce or the calamari or both? Both. Wow. Really? I'm excited for this, dude. You know what you should I'm do? You should get a little this. spoon and try this. No, thank you. Check out these rubber bands. Are those octopi legs or squid? Is it squid or octopus? Calamari is so good. Are you mute, you dumb bitch? Are you not hearing the questions that I'm asking you right now? Because I don't know the answer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, I can see te uh, suction cups on there, right? Uh huh. Bro, you just be eating it's them. It's so good. You How do you not like calamari? You eat beetles off the ground, too? Mm hmm. You're Cockroaches. You're a freak. Tacos. Tacos. So, tacos, we got what is it? Burrito Bandito? Burning Bandito? <laughs> Burrito Bandito! <laughs> Next skin sriracha sauce. I'm super stoked about this. I am too. So, we got a short rib taco each, oh, and we got. Over by you and we got a carnitas taco each. 
uh, from Big and Littles, which has been featured on Triple D and all kinds of shows. Big and Littles is it's one of our favorite spots. Amazing. Yeah. All right, the sauce pour. I'm doing it right-handed. This is difficult. For you me. can do it. Use your offhand. I'm trying you to weirdo. Get... Oh, I like that. You... Mm. Oh, I like how much you put on there. Mm. Why are you there making weird go. sound effects? I'm excited. I know, but I feel like you're embellishing how much you'd really be moaning and Plus, groaning. it's really hard to dude, do Dude, holy right crap, dude. It's hard. This is my non-dominant hand. I'm trying to not block the do field it. of vision. I, I appreciate I'm you trying. I'm trying to be a good, cinematic, glory-filled human. You can do it. There you go. Yeah. Dude, you know, if we're going to do it, you might as well do it big. Go big or go home or use your non-dominant hand and then you don't know what, how you're going to go. And drink scotch and yell at your significant other. I love you! <laughs> Alright, we're going to start with the carnitas taco from Big and Littles. Cheers. Cheers, Big Mike. Mmm. Love that label, by the way. Mmm. I'm going, look at that. Oh yeah, look that was that. a big bite I needed. I want like a bunch oh, of yeah. it. That's good. My first bite didn't have any yet. That's good. Mmm, that's really good. Oh yeah. We always have our hot sauces with chicken wings, and Mike was like, would you guys get a bunch of food if I throw you some money and don't just eat Wingstop chicken wings? We're like, okay. Fine. <laughs> I'm so glad he suggested this, dude. This Mexican one, serrano peppers, tomato sauce, oh baby, onion powder, garlic powder, red pepper, chipotle peppers, and adobo. Oh, all the spices in that are really, really good. That is, dude, if you saw this on the table at your local Mexican restaurant, <coughs> like if you went to Tarasca's and that was sitting on the, ch the table, you'd be all about it. Dude, I'd be laddering myself up in that. Oh, buy it. Oh, buy it. I'd be clothed right there, then do it. <laughs> <laughs> mm. All right, now the beef short rib taco. That first one was good, dude. Also, shout out to Big and Littles has no idea we're doing this. Shout out to Big and Littles, though. Big and Littles. Their tacos are so good. Their freaking ahi poke crunch wrap is my favorite thing. Cheers. Everything there is so good. Oh, man. Mmm. Wow. It looks very similar to the other one. Very good on this. Oh, yeah. This dude knows how to do it. Yeah. Also, mm -hmm. how sick of a name is Chef Iron Mike? That's pretty badass. Like, people know you that? Do you think his, like, significant other slash family calls him that? Oh, Chef Iron um, Mike! You just said, and people know you that? <laughs> I'm good at talking. Like, people know you that? Like, people know you that? Like, people know you that? People know you that. Like, people know you that? Also, in other great words, this, these two hot sauces we've had so far, they're not, like, so spicy that you're in pain. Like, these, mm. are, the ty these are the types of ones, like, if you're, an, if you're, if you're kind of, like, a, a hit or miss hot sauce person, you dig these. If you're a little on the spicy end, mm -hmm. like, if you like things, if you're like, I'm the guy who kind of likes things out of my friend group. I'm not a psycho about it, but I'm better than the rest of those. Yeah. Oh, man, and last but not least. Bro is the food tire of Chicago. This doesn't look soupy. It doesn't. We I'm excited. This is what I, I'm, this looks like some good deep dish. Wow. Bring it in for the real thing. Look at that. So as you guys know, La Briola Cafe is our favorite what deep dish that? place, but this is Jim inch, inch and a quarter, two inches? Yeah, dude, you thick. can, uh, pull your dick out. Let's see how thick that is. You think Chef Iron Mike uh, wants to hear that? But look at that, dude. That's, that's like the, as thick as the Bible. <clears throat> Let's go more that direction. <laughs> <laughs> Have I ever told you guys that I love our show? This is uh, Vesuvius. Right. Mount Fire Mike's Italian Sriracha Sauce, Vesuvius. Shout out to Mount Vesuvius, dude. Shout out to Mount Vesuvius, bro. Oh, okay. I would like to get something yeah. besides just meat on these, but when you do that, it waters it down. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, don't touch that one. Now you've touched both of them. I want to do that one because you already put your grimy ass. You my hands this aren't one. grimy, dude. You've touched this one left. Well, that's my meat if it fell. Yes, I ain't dibs. touching your meat. Have you ever seen somebody so possessive of pizza meat? Well, that's my meat. Mean if it fell. Go back and watch it. Don't, don't you touch this one last. <laughs> I want to know. I need to know because that was so aggressive and I realized moment after. Tell me if that was the most aggressive in the comments. Let me know. Is that the most aggressive you've ever seen the man go after a little chunk of pizza meat? Dude, you're checking a lot of boxes today. <laughs> well, that's my mean if it fell. All right, this is Giordano's meat meat surprise with all bunch of Vesuvius. Boom. Cheers. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. I like this slice. Oh, this is lasagna. It is grandma's lasagna, mm -hmm. without a doubt. But I will say, this is really good. Not getting vegetables really helps it. This is really, really good. Oh, uh, this is a stuffed pizza. So Chicago, you know yours here, deep dish? This is the Giordano stuffed pizza. What's that mean? It was all inside. Is there another thing? Like stuffed, and they also have not stuffed, or you just say not stuffed, or what? Yeah, like some of the deep dish places, like it still looks similar, but Giordano's, I think, was one of the first to like, when you see it, it's like the flap of the top, you open it up and everything's in there, all compartmentalized. That's what stuffed is. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Oh wow, this hot sauce is good. This is a good deep dish, too. It really is. And that hot sauce is amazing. What do you think of the sauce, though? I can see why this is an Italian. It's got like, this is the spiciest one we've had. This sauce. Yeah, I'm, not I'm, gonna, getting, I'm, it, not I'm getting, getting it. I'm getting it like right here. You've been getting weaker on me. Mm hmm. 
Oh yeah, this is an incredible, it's almost like a spicy tomato sauce. It's really good. Wow, I can't believe how much I like this. Me too. I yep. tried that other hot sauce, I knew I was gonna like this hot sauce, yeah. that was a no brainer. Uh huh. This pizza, now I get why people like deep dish. The other stuff I've been having has just been garbage examples. Right. Labriola is still better by a billion because their crust is a bil literally a billion times better. Yeah, that better. caramelized crust is way, way it's better. It's unbelievable. Yeah. But this is, now at least I get it. I'm, I want to take this home. Like, I would put this on every slice of pizza I have. There's something about how it mixes with the tomato sauce and yeah, the cheese. Yeah, you're right. It's like giving it a spice that seems like they almost made it in it. Look at it. It almost has the same consistency as right. sauce. Yeah, I'm taking Isn't that, that weird? Look at all this bread, though. Like, that's so unnecessary. Mm -hmm. Calamari, two tacos, and deep dish pizza, all because Chef Iron Mike, baby. Dude, I gotta have another slice. I know, I might too. Look, these are too small ones, you won't feel Yeah. Them. You want the smaller the small one or the bigger the small one? Smaller, small. A little piece of bacon. Thought you were gonna skate me. This is good. I'm a fan. Mm. All right, Mike, I am thankful to you today for two things. One, for these hot sauces that are absolutely amazing. I can't get over how good they are. Two, I don't think I would've been trying this Giordano's anytime soon. Giordano. If it wasn't for him, that's good, that's good stuff. Thank you. So get this, he comes out with three new sauces like every Shut three up. or four months. That quick? So he's gonna send us, he said, the next three very shortly, because we've been sitting on these for a little bit, and we get to do this all over again with three new foods. Dude, does this guy have like a lab? He's just down there just experimenting, <laughs> making dope ass hot sauce. I think they all call time? that a kitchen, dude. That's awesome. That's good stuff. That's so Italy to put salami on a pizza. Salami e formaggio. On the count of three, pick your favorite sauce from Iron Mike. Uh -huh. One, two, three. I wanted all of them. I tried to grab all of them. Christ. It's like picking a favorite child. Those are all really, 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 really good. I'm gonna pick a favorite child. My favorite child is my firstborn. He's the only one that's amounted to anything, Mr. Vesuvius. But these other two as well, mm -hmm. I want that Mexican one on all my tacos and burritos, and I want that Bloody Mary mm -hmm. all over. Yeah. My, my Bloody Marys and also my calamaris. And here's my breakdown on it. Yeah. It tastes really good, and it's got a good amount of heat. So if you're looking for something super hot, probably not for you. Right. But if you're looking for something that's gonna get, kick you in the face, just a smidgen, like a little nudge right. from a boot, yeah. then these are the things to do. For your sign off today, I'm gonna go against everything that the Iron Man told me and put all three hot sauces on this last slice oh, that's of gonna, Jadam. That's gonna summon the hot sauce demon, don't do it! The hot sauce demon <laughs> came to me last night in a toilet dream. <laughs> all right, look at this, ready? All three sauces. I bet that tastes so good. It tastes like seafood Mexican pizza. Sweet, hell yeah. Sure, I'll have a spicy slice.